Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I am back and um, I took a couple of days off again and um, I just been following my intuition later in our early, um, lately and um, it's just been um, me following what my my mind is telling me. Not my mind but I guess my heart in a way like kind of like what what would I do? What, what, what do I want to do? Like what excites me? So last week I went and I booked a, um, a, a getaway weekend for you know for me and my partner and we just went away for um, two days, uh, well three days and two nights. Um, and um, since I've been f trying to figure out how to uh, really you know uh, dive in and, and and meditate more and trying to master uh not master i guess that's never a good thing but trying to work on myself and um trying to understand where i am and who am i and and what am i here for um as wayne Dyer would say the late great uh self actualize um i figured it would be great to just get away from the whole uh, hectic life and the kids i got three girls and uh and uh Tony, Bella, I'm I'm shooting a video, I'll be right with you. Can I eat these chips? I'll be right with you. Uh, I'll be right with you. Um Can I eat these chips? Yeah. Um so sorry about that interruption. Um see three girls. I got three girls, yeah. It's this uh it's a twenty four seven thing. So I figured let's let's go the way and let's leave the kids with the mother in law and uh and uh see if we can just take a break and find ourselves um, so we ended up going to um, the Catskills up in upstate New York uh, never been there first time I didn't know what I was gonna go and do I didn't know what was gonna happen I just said let's go and book a, a cottage or a cabin and the um, funny thing was I ended up booking it on Airbnb uh, a great uh, um, sorry about that um, a cottage and uh, and I didn't know what to expect I never done any Airbnb before um, it was just uh, like I said it was just like an intuition thing let's just go and it'll be a great uh, trip and a great um, exploration for us we never been there first time and um, it was a great great uh, um, um, just like a great mental relaxation uh self exploration of myself and and of where we stand and what we are and who we are and I can pause in life like of just basically doing nothing um we had no plans we had no no itinerary like we didn't know what we were gonna do. The best thing I did was ask one of the hosts, which she was a great host, and I, I recommend anybody going out to the Catskills, which is a great, they have a, you can go ahead and go skiing, um, I heard in the summertime and the springtime is great for like uh, water rafting, uh, um, uh, hiking, obviously a lot of hiking, great scenic views, uh, they have lakes, so I'm guessing you can go ahead and, and ride boats, um, um, they have a bunch of ski resorts up in the mountains, so it's a very active uh, uh, and very a lot of activities for those that like to be outdoors, and also just those that want to see the mother nature it has such great, great, great uh, scenery, uh, mountains, rivers, creeks, lakes, uh, beautiful landscapes. It's something that I've I was in awe of driving over there. So. Um, being that I'm from New York City, you rarely see that on a daily basis. So um, it was so calming, so at ease. Um, I was able to just, like I said, just we just booked it, took a drive, took a couple of uh, pair of clothes, and we just went away for a couple of nights. Um, uh, also, being away, uh, I was able to realize that. Um, Meditating, I meditated for about two hours in the morning each day since I was up early, and we had nothing to do, <laughs> no kids around, and and no type of uh, agenda. Right, um, I felt liberated in a way, in a way I just felt such at peace with myself. Uh, and um, I highly recommend uh, those that are on a journey of trying to find out 
who they are or what they're here for, um, just go ahead and take a book a weekend and just uh, 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 just just follow your heart, like wherever it is that you feel like you want to go and explore something you haven't seen before. It's just the excitement of of you getting away and 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 seeing something new and trying something new without you even knowing what the results are. Um, so it kind of gave me a great recharge. Came back today and and, and I'm I'm like a little bit more at ease with with what it is that excites me. Um, and I kind of think we lose that aspect. We kind of get the same mundane activities every day. And of course, I'm grateful for what I'm doing and what are we doing here and we're alive every day. But it's like we get a, a, um, accustomed to the routine, right? And then we just forget about everything else that excites us when we were younger or when we were just teenagers. Like, what was it that excited you? Was the new thing? Was the exploring? Was the, it was the just, you know, not knowing what was going to happen. You just went on and took a trip and things would happen and uh um the funny thing is um like unknown to me i did not know they have a, a they have a uh obviously a, a there's a chapter of the buddhist or buddhism out there the temple um and we ran into a temple because the host gave us some suggestions to check out and we were able to check out the town of woodstock uh, the town of uh, Phoenicia was that was where we actually stayed for the for the cottage, um, and um, we drove over to Woodstock, which is about twenty minutes, and it was uh, in there that you go and you drive up and you see the temple, and uh, right along the right along the hiking trail, uh, and it's it's uh, it's so at peace, it's so such beauty in the mother nature they're literally right on, almost on the top of them like at the peak of the mountain and you see the whole the whole mountains you can see a couple of mountains from there and a couple of views and it's it's an it's a it's a scene that you got to go in person i can't even explain it to you but um being that i'm following the meditation and i'm following the um uh trying to master my mind or, or at least understand it um it's like a great coincidence because there are they are like the believers of meditation and that's what they do on a, on a on a on a daily basis and they believe in um um just uh just being right not a lot of doing just being just being with yourself and um i figured that was awesome that was like an awesome convenience and coincidence right so we bumped into that um and it was just uh, a a little place of nirvana as they call it as a buddhism called nirvana which is that level you reach where you have no desires and and no suffering so it's um it's a very rejuvenating um uh, i think i came back with a lot of uh thought and respect for meditation and for stillness and for everything i'm trying to learn that i'm always uh broadcasting to you guys through this channel um that sometimes uh when you feel like you're in that rut and you feel like you don't have enough ideas or you feel like just just very occupied um it's okay to just take a break and just like disconnect from the the you know the, your everyday life um because staying in your in your area or staying in your apartment you're gonna get calls from your friends and family's gonna come and visit and, and we have kids i think you have to get away from it for a little bit and just take a mental break from everything i didn't use my phone i didn't record any videos i didn't uh um i try not to get on social media um and uh update any posts um <clears throat> i think i did like maybe once but i try to stay away from it just literally just be with just basically do nothing just just be with myself uh think ideas and think about you know we could have been born anywhere i could have been born in the Catskills, but i was born in new york city so i could have had that life i could have been in the country right and maybe not appreciate the beauty um, of what I was around um, so being that I'm not from there I went over there and I appreciated such a great landscapes and mountains and and the animals and it's just um, it's just something that you like it's it's nature has such much beauty to offer and I think I'm at peace when I'm in nature and it was pretty awesome to go and take that just unexpected trip and I suggest that everybody goes and, and at least once once or twice every six months try to escape 
uh, the daily life and routine. And even if it's just, like I said, if it could be a quick drive. It doesn't have to be you traveled into another country or you were to another part of the world, which is going to probably cost you a little bit more money. Um, just a couple hundred bucks. Go to, you know, take a, if you have a car, take a drive. If not, you can take a bus. But just just get away from wherever it is that you're at. Change your environment. And, um, and it might gives you it might you might you might be surprised by the benefits you might get from that and uh the the excitement of the unknown and how your brain is triggered in different ways and i'm pretty sure it has a lot of science behind it and i'm not sure because i'm not a scientist but i think uh um i respect it i respect when people say take breaks i never believed in that i never thought that that was an actually an, an antidote but it works man like go out there do something different, change it up, follow your heart, whatever it is you feel like you want to do, just do it, um, and don't think about it, like, oh, I don't know what I'm going to do, what we're going to be at, what we're going to go, what we're going to do for dinner, just go, get there, you figure it out, you always figure it out, trust me, I figured it out, and it was awesome, and it's something that I would do again if I had the chance, um, and I'm looking forward to doing it again, just disconnecting, and uh, not knowing, just showing up, and uh and it's funny because isn't that what life is about? Like we just don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow, or in a week, or in two weeks, or in four weeks, or in six months, or in one year. But we just show up, and um, and just just uh, just be right, and uh, everything will figure it out. So that's my advice for today. Take care, guys.